Hello everyone, my name is Wendy, I'm from Malawi. First of all, I'd like to say thank you for giving me this opportunity to speak about women on women. Um, it was such an honor for me to be invited on this forum so that I can say something about women, something that women go through in each and every day of our lives. The first thing I'd like to talk about is domestic violence. Domestic violence is very common in my country, Malawi. You see that most of the women are being abused by their own husbands. For example, a man will be coming from work, he'll come back home drunk, and when he gets home, he starts beating up his wife, mostly for no reason at all. Sometimes some men even beat up their own children. At the end of the day, the children and the woman, they are left bruised all over their body and wounded as well. To me, I see this as a crime because not only is the man disrespecting his wife by beating her up, it is also a bad thing to do to a fellow human being because most of the times women are regarded as powerless because physically we are not stronger than men. So they take advantage of that and abuse us. Instead of them protecting us, at the end of the day, we are being abused by the people who are supposed to be protecting us. So to, to me, I see this as a crime. And any man who does this to his wife or children is supposed to be sent to prison. Because I think that will be the best punishment for that man to receive. And the other thing I would like to talk about is rape. In most of the countries, most in my country, Malawi as well, you'll find that when a person is raped, they say that, oh, maybe, maybe she wasn't dressed well, maybe she was wearing something short, maybe she was exposing her body, and that's what triggered the man to rape her. But we'll find that most of the people who are raped in my country, they are very, very small little girls, maybe the age of six or the age of five or the age of ten, People who are very, very small, very, very small children, they are being raped by men. And then at the end of the day, they say that it's the dressing. But to me, I don't think it's the dressing at all. I don't think we are being raped because of our dressing. This is another way of men taking advantage of us. They take advantage of little, little children because they know that they cannot do anything to defend themselves. They know that they cannot do anything. And for example, in my life, I've always been told by my parents that I'm not supposed to go out when it's dark because men can harass me or men can rape me. You see? It's like I was given a time to be at home. For example, my grandma would tell me that, hey, you know what? You're supposed to be home before five. You're not supposed to be here before dark. I mean, you're supposed to be here before dark. Why? Because we are afraid of men. At the end of the day, it's like, instead of them protecting them, they do to us. So to me, I feel like men who does this to little girls, even to women as well, they are supposed to be to be given a very harsh punishment because when a girl is raped, most of the most of them their future is ruined. Because the act of rape is very traumatizing for a very small girl. The act of rape is very tra tra is very traumatizing for anyone who goes through that. To me, I know the pain because I've seen people who have been raped before. I've heard their stories and they are not good at all. So honestly I'm impressed by this forum that women are coming to speak about issues of fair women as well. To me I think this is very this is a very good thing. It can be empowering to other women as well. It can be helpful to other women who couldn't speak for them for themselves. Thank you.